if y'all ain't convinced about 2024 being the greatest year for hip hop, or at least the greatest year in like the last 10, 15 years, I don't know what to tell you, man. This year has definitely surpassed 2016 for me. Like, bro, I just dropped a video. Y'all can check my channel right now if you don't believe me. I just dropped a video like three, four hours ago reacting to the Vault 2. Because I just seen that shit drop. I just seen the Vault 2 for Travis's Days Before Rodeo drop. And now we're already back reacting to Vault 3, bro. Not even, not even 12 hours later. Not even six hours later. This is like right after. This shit is crazy, bro. I haven't seen... Man, I don't think I've ever seen this many, like, big artists. Like, there's been a couple big names who have double dropped or triple dropped in the fucking same day or the same week. It's like, the shit has been wild, bro. This year has been such a potent year, such an abundant year for hip-hop, for, like, especially when the genre was kind of dying off, like, up until this point. This is so great for the year, man. It's so so great for the art. We got new Travis again, bro. I've ne I never thought I'd see the day... I'm reacting to Travis, and then a couple hours later, I'm reacting to new Travis. And it's not like I'm reacting to old shit either, bro. Like, this shit is crazy. But yeah, we got two new tracks. We got Naughty, which I heard has Metro production. Let's see let's see how that sounds. And then we got another track. What was the other one? With Young Thug. Uh, too Many Options with Young Thug. Yeah, man. I ain't gonna do no long talking. We gonna get straight into this shit. Y'all enjoyed this video. You know what to do. Let's go. We're listening to Naughty first. Straight into it. Okay, so if this one is the Metro Produce song, I think this one actually is of that days before or rodeo era, because this sounds like old Metro producing too. Let alone Travis's voice. You can kind of hear like the raspiness that he had back in the, like back in the, his younger days. But even the production that Metro has, it sounds like of an older Metro sound that he was going for back in those times. All the girls in the party. All the girls want to get in All the girls sneaking up the alley. All the girls want to have a Y'all let me know if y'all feeling these these additional vault tracks because I gotta be honest, like even with this track, the beat is really I don't even know if it's necessarily saving it, but like like I'm willing to listen to the end because of the beat, really. Because what Travis is doing right here, just I don't know, it just ain't for me. So far, like from Vault 2 and Vault 3, I don't think there's been a track that I've actually wanted, like I'm been content with her. Like I'm I'm taking that away for sure. Like They've all kind of been skips for me. And another thing that I feel like I should have mentioned in my last video because I noticed this was a recurring theme in the other two tracks as well is that his flow doesn't change at all, bro. Like, granted, okay, let me let me be fair, bro, because I'm I know that assuming some of these tracks are in the days before rodeo era, this is his development era where he's still kind of figuring shit out. But like, I think it's still fair for me to be critical because the actual albums, the projects that came out in those eras, the days before rodeo that came out, the rodeo that came out were so phenomenal that like, you would think that the tracks that he's throwing away are at least half as good or at least like comparable. I don't know. Maybe, 
maybe this track is just it's intended to be like a very psychedelic track because like i can kind of hear like the slurring in his voice and i could imagine like it's one of those like in the club off some lsd or off some fucking molly or some shit you listen to this shit it might go because it's just like a very druggy feel but like on some regular shit i don't know bro i don't know all right let's get into this travis young thug too many options track i'm hoping man yo please Please come on some shit, bro. Come on some shit. Let's go. Okay, I know this is old. I feel like I've heard this beat before. Okay. This could be something. I feel it. Come on, Trev. Yeah. Woo! This is, ooh, this is old though. This is old though. Oh my goodness. Yo. Okay. Okay. We in a bag right now. We in a bag right now. This is old thug. Yeah. I like this. I like this. I know this. This one can't be bad, bro. This one can't be bad. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm, oh, okay, okay. I have heard this before. Okay, let's go. Let's go. We up. bro that shit was fire bro like he could have dropped that with the with the first five pack bro and that shit would have fit right in i because I, I think i think that first five he dropped was so tough like every song he dropped was so tough the original album i mean we don't even gotta talk about that bro that's days before rodeo and then he just dropped these vault packs and it just i don't know bro i was just i was just feeling like yo like I had a whole idea for what the title of this video was gonna be and everything. If he did, if he didn't give me this shit right here, oh my god, I was about to go crazy, bro. I was about to, be, I about to be a fucking hater. But yo, this shit was tough, bro. This one right here, too many options. This is going in the playlist for sure. We're gonna be running this one right here. Yeah, man, definitely the best one by far, by far out of the four tracks we've gotten. Hopefully, if you, if Travis is planning to drop more vault packs, I hope we get more of these songs. That other one, yeah, y'all can keep that one. The, that vault two you can keep that shit this one right here this is what we need bro travis please take note if you drop in more vaults we need more of this type of sound bro y'all let me know what y'all thought about the tracks how y'all feeling about vault two vault three you feel me which which tracks you like and not like it let me know in the comments below and i'm gonna see you on the next video bro i'm gonna catch y'all